You will know him as uh, one of the stars of Logo's Setup Squad. <gasps> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Jonathan Lovett. Jonathan! Lovett, love him. Come on up, Jonathan. And guess what? He's cute. Cute! Oh, Hello. He's turned Hi. on. Hi, we're talking about all my favorite things. Politics, uh, American know. Horror Story, college football. I'm very turned on. Okay, so we just want to talk about, like, the state of dating in New York. Okay. Does anyone really date? Well, yes. When they turn off all those push notifications on Grindr, yes, uh. they can. Um, and I've learned, you know, that New York is full of incredibly kind, wonderful, amazing, highly dateable people, and also others. Yeah. <laughs> A lot of others. That's when dating turns into the, you know, it's auditioning with a two-drink minimum. <laughs> you know what I mean? We're, we're going out, we're having a couple of drinks, I'm finding out, are you husband material, are you sex material, are you any of the above, no thank you, dancing with the eye on the door, looking for the some, you know, someone younger, cuter, in a higher tax bracket. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so if you actually have five minutes to go on a date in New York, it's, it's hard, and you've got to make that count. It seems so ADD. Everybody's so ADD with the phones and the texting, and, you know, what? it's hard to ha you're right. <laughs> it's hard to... You know, Look a light. I know. Oh, it's pretty. <laughs> hey, boobs. <laughs> don't do your homework. You know, as soon as you get their full name, don't Facebook them, don't Wikipedia them, don't, don't go looking for their sexual predator profile. You get, when you have the full dossier on someone, then what's the point of going on the date? Right. One of the clients in an episode we had literally walked in with a checklist and said, have you done X, Y, and Z? Are you interested in A, B, and C? Have you committed felonies one, two, and three? <laughs> because think about some of the best relationships any of us ever had. It was that person who, at the time, probably seemed like the last one we wanted to end up with. Well, chemistry. Somebody can look great on paper. And if there's not Honey, chemistry, I it's know. all about the pheromones and the smells. And I need to look in your eyes, Girl, baby. Girl, and I need to make sure what? you can kiss right. <laughs> If you really feel Agreed. that connection with someone, go with it. Let that relationship with someone that you never thought you'd be with scare the hell out of you, as all the best things in life do. That thing that scares you is gonna probably be the thing that changes your life for the best. Yeah, exactly, no, but you know what? They're, they're out there, you're not the only one. Find him, and he's out there. So, you know, know that you're in this for the long haul and know that somebody else is too. We all have it in ourselves to be a leader. You know, I, one of the things I try to instill upon the college generation I speak to, I say, you know what? Our parents' generation, the Harvey Milk generation, for them, their legacy was coming out was enough. N you know, just bolster the numbers. Right. Well, now we've got the numbers. Look around. Right. Go make people talk. You talk. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Jonathan Lovett. Love him.